96,000 XP to go. We've got two of those, but this one's worth 18k XP, and all we're going to do is get to the last roof. Wait, didn't we already get the quest to kill Sanitar done? I thought we did that. No, we haven't. Okay. Must be my main account. We can do um, some dorms runs too. I want to go. I want to go one one chance to Lighthouse to try and get to get uh, that reconnaissance done, and then after that, I think we go. Fair customs. All right, let's do it. Lighthouse. Oh god. We don't even need to kill all the stuff. We just got to get to the actual place. No, I haven't played Lost Eve Hawk. Just kill me for the fact that. Um. You know, I was thinking of Lost Ark. I haven't played it either. I may Studios will save us. Maybe. No rope today, not today. I'm, it's just really hot at the moment in this house. Still waiting for my Phasma stream? Yeah, one day. One day. They came up with nothing Soviet. You ever try a scum? I've played it multiple times, bro. It's just... It, it gives me the same vibe as Day Z. Like, it can be fun, but it just feels... I don't know. I don't know the word for it. It just feels... Frustrating at times. Oh, what the fuck? Why is he not there? He should be there. Well, we're going around. AZ is without doubt the biggest scam in recent gaming history. Star Citizen enters the chat. I shouldn't say that. I actually don't know too much about Star Citizen. I wasn't using an SKS. Star Citizen can be fun, but fucking hell, every patch just keeps breaking shit. I'm waiting for 4.0 to try again. Tarkov can be fun, but fucking hell, every patch just keeps breaking shit. I'm waiting for 1.0 to try again. Like, you could literally re rephrase that Star Citizen right there with Tarkov, and it's the exact same thing. Any interest in dead drop like the disrespect game? Yep. I just I haven't had time to have a look. Pretty much every moment I've had spare lately in the last like month I've been working on this Europe trip. So I pretty much fully planned both first and second Europe trips now. Fuck off. Why are you not dead? See a bandit. 
to cheat a little bit here. Wait, was that a 50 kill shooting at me? Or just a guy shooting? few tasks. One of them's like kill raiders, kill rogues. Hello? Hello? I fucking spawned up here. What's up with that? That's bullshit. They shouldn't do that. I heard the guy pull the flare back from the other end. Can't really see that guy's fifty cal from here. Oh, 
might be dead. Someone shot him. You should be one on the other side of this. Vector, thanks for 13 months. How's this gonna put us way it was? Ooh, good ammo. Someone coming up. Feeling that I was almost um, at the library for this account. Die though. I think we move. I think we spent enough time up here. Uh, I don't see any car there. You guys? Oh, you can see it through the bus. No. All right. Don't run away. Why no PS? Uh, didn't have any. Maybe I'll go on the inside.
Mm, I don't know if he's on, gone on the roof or not. Seal, thanks for two months, mate. Speaking of Seal, how good is Seal's music? <clears throat> Hello? Reconnaissance done. Has this dude been looted? That should be a telltale sign. Doesn't look like it. Overweight. Do something. Anything. That's five armor. I don't want to leave it behind. Very lootable. Oh. And pest, are you hung like a horse? Sorry, this my bra. Got a sergeant. Okay, apparently that doesn't fit. May have just wasted a muzzle. How does that not fit? I need to get underweight. How are you doing, Pest? I'm good, mate. I'm good. It's pre med. Use this to try and get up.
to young Bucky Poo. Thanks for seven months, dude. Lizzle, thanks for 22 months, man. I'm doing well, mate. How you doing? Finding a player. Shooting? They're actually shooting a white air to sequel? Realsies? I guess that, that goal was near the uh, extract, I guess. Totally different dude to the one I was fighting underneath. Yeah, that or the audio went to shit. I think I just need to survive a lighthouse right now and reconnaissance is finished. So that's easy. Yeah, M61, apparently. Yeah, I think all I need to do now is survive lighthouse and I've got reconnaissance done. So I can actually go and do... Long Road and the the villas. What was the quest where you got to kill rogues? I swear I fucking got close. Must have must have got close to getting that done. Outcast. All right. I was going to kill two more and I get that done. What's the helicopter quest? We have pretty much lost all my armors though. It's kind of shit. Not pretty much. We have. We have lost all my armors for that one. We get a CD. Need a rig then. We could. Why not? Do it. I think we got heaps of SVD mags. All right. Five, six, seven. And we've got that there. Cool. You already traveled a lot watching the trailer. Uh, I think the trailer is completely done with uh, pretty much just Indonesia, I think. Oh, and a bit of personal stuff from before. Maybe I could just lay here for a minute. Have a gander. Did you ever visit Croatia? We're going Croatia on the first trip. Be cool if you can get into the BSG offices. It's not going to happen. There is no visas to Russia right now. Plus, I think I get enough flack for just playing Escape from Tarkov. Visiting Russia in current times would be, um, I think it would make people crack a bit of a stir, I think. Kind of sucks, like, I hope you guys can take this the wrong way, but, like, I try and always see the beauty in every country and it sucks that the, the political climate of Russia right now reflects so poorly on Russian people. You know what I mean? Like... I've heard so many beautiful things about Russia and, and its people and because of this war, it's like... Everything Russia is like the devil. Anyway, Wolf, thanks for 28 months, dude. 28 months, much love. Thanks, dude. Much love back, bro. The majority of Russian people support the war. Two things. One, how the fuck would you even possibly know that? And two, um, even if they did support the war as a majority, like, how much of that is, is purely because they don't understand the full facts of the war, you know? Who's that guy on YouTube that does a really good video about the media censorship? 
YouTube channel was I on? Oh, I need to figure this out. Johnny Harris. He did a really good video on it. Let's move on just because it's such a fasty topic for chat that I just don't want to get bogged down on it. I'd rather speak about other stuff. We'll pretty much be flying into Greece on... What's been through here? The door's open. Fly to Greece. I leave on Friday. I get there Saturday. I got one night in in Athens while I'll wait for Deki to land. Well, Deki lands like midnight, so. And then once Deki lands, um, we're heading up north towards. Albania. Um, we're staying near the airport on the first night because the whole purpose on the first night is literally just to stay there for decades of land and us to get any supplies that we need for the drive. Um, but we will be in back in Albania. Sorry, it will be back in Greece around the 22nd, 23rd. If anyone's in Athens and that, we'll probably be able to do a meetup around then. We're hoping to live stream as much as possible, by the way, guys. So, some countries I think will be really good for live streaming and other countries will just be shit. Based off reception alone. Vertex, are you here? And a mule. We meet, need that, apparently. Oh, that's why we were crafting it. So I need to craft the mule. Do you tend to contact the cruise board of each country to get sponsorships? No. Sounds like way too much effort and way too many questions. So you're going to film our country. I have 10 days to spend as a tourist in Australia. Mm -hmm. Should I do Sydney or Melbourne? Melbourne. Like Sydney, you'll, you, you'll see everything good in Sydney in about 48 hours. And then after that, you'll be like, fuck, what now? And then you'll spend your whole time just like... Hating life. Like Sydney, Ar Sydney Harbour Bridge and Sydney Opera House is like the main like draw cards. And then after that, it's just busy city. Be Sherman 42 Wallaby Way, Sydney. Wait, when are you going, Blizzle? Like, in winter, I would say stay away from both Melbourne and Sydney. Uh, Dyson92, thanks for 26 months. In winter, I'd say go Brisbane and then up to Cairns or something. I 
need to learn all the, uh, the vertex horns. There was a heap of shooting at the Raiders earlier. The rogues, I should say. Could have been a player. A player scav. prefer to play on 1080p or higher. I play on 1440p. This show is beautiful, but it's just expensive. Like for the cost to go over to Western Australia and, and do everything over there, you could easily fly to Asia and have like a nice cheaper holiday that you can, you know, live like kings and queens. case for anywhere in Australia these days. Perth is pretty expensive though, bro. Like I'd say Perth is pretty much on par with like Sydney for accommodation and, and all that, plus the flights to get over there. You have some kick-ass meals on your recent Indonesia trip? Yeah, we pretty much ate all local food. I, I took the guys out for street food and that as well. Vertex try you take one and two saves. I don't think I've got the keys. Nope. Nah. I'm just dead. Better than nothing. What the fuck? It's gonna die. Uh, excuse me. Shouldn't be through the fence. Oh, there he is. Page. Oh, you fucking sack. Oh, 
Oh, the mirroring key. We should get out. Oh, why did I ID that? Mary might be able to get us a vertex, so we should get out. What's bad about ITing? In Hindcore, I can put a non ID key into my container. I oh, know this rock comes jam. We'll get there. We got a couple of kills for like long road and um the other one cottage one i think they've increased the spawn chance of keys for that map on that specific map so if you like loot and following cabinets on reserve you've got a high chance of getting reserve keys if you're looting keys on um lighthouse you're going to have a high chance of getting a lighthouse key which i think is a good change i think it's a good change because I, I definitely like went reserve and i went and found like eight keys in like six following cabinets so all reserve keys i'll be in europe for five weeks I don't know how to say your name, but I'll call you My Sly. My Sly. Uh, we'll get rid of our B key, maybe. To get rid of operating rooms, kind of pointless now. All right, Merrin. All right, hand that in for samples. We've got two to go. We should be able to hand in reconnaissance. We take that with us this time. Might take the shotgun with us. We're not going to go over there, so. Get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that. That'll do. Um, Helmet. Cool, we go again. I want to know if you guys meant uh, went with uh, Embracing Life Before Death motto after... Someone read Tomlot Arcot. Uh, unfortunately not. Oh, that's not how we got to that. We didn't want it to be bucket list because it's not exactly about a bucket list. Like, obviously there's things we want to do before we die. Right? But it's also about if something cool comes our way, we want to try and, and do it, you know? And live it. So we we played around with a lot of different words and names and, and stuff. The the biggest issue that I think we ran into was we didn't want it to sound like we're terminally ill. I say a trailer for before death is so amazing and really hot for the videos dude i have watched the video that's about to come come out in about seven hours time i'm not even exaggerating i've probably watched it 30 times and i, I still enjoy it's it's honestly my favorite video i've ever been a part of making we've put so much time and effort into making it I'm surprised we'll spend four days in Hungary. Our mountains are so small. So the highest peak in Hungary is like 30 minutes to climb. It's it's like it's like a fucking little tower thing. But it's more about we want to explore the country. And I think that's... No, it's not a rest day. A rest day is going to be in Romania, I think. So every, there's two rest days throughout the whole trip where the guys can... They're going to get their own hotel room and get to stay wherever the fuck they want. I'll do whatever the fuck they want. Like, I'm not going to... They're not dictated by by me on what they have to do that day. So, they get, a, they get a couple of days over the trip where they get to relax. They can literally go watch a movie or sleep or whatever. Or they can hang out. Like, I'm going to probably just do a heap of admin, do my washing, all that kind of stuff. We were going to Slovakia. We put, we cancelled it. Like we, we pulled it off the list um, in last minute. 
what you see underneath the stream right now is the is the official like these are the dates and stuff we've already like we're organizing flights and that for the second trip right now and the first trip's locked in the only thing is like if weather goes to shit, then we'll probably end up spending extra days in certain locations and rushing others. Potentially, at least. I'll have to wait and see. I've only booked accommodation for the first two nights of the trip. And the last... And, and the turkey section. Poland will be on this trip number three. So if anything's not on the list, guys, it's on trip three. Like we will literally get every country that we missed on the third trip. But it, it's it's going to get reorganized. We're, we're, we've, we've kind of like just got trip number three as a question mark when we're going to do it. Oh, you smuggle me in your suit games. Well, if we take you to Slovakia, we might actually be able to make some money by doing that. Anyone seen the movie Hostel? What any food recommendations? the Balkan countries all right now but when you're actually there yep um the aim is to live stream about 20 hours a week so we'll most likely 100 we'll be live streaming during daylight hours so if you're in one of those countries and you want to help give us suggestions and that will be all ears movie gave my country a bad name. <laughs> what do you mean? The women are beautiful. Just don't go to bed with them. She might wake up in a torture chamber. Is he in the close one or the far one? All right, let's see if it's a scav. The player. around isn't that true for all women from every from anywhere maybe wouldn't know i'm a gamer i play video games
the person talking about it got, going to Northern Europe. Um, I'm going to Scandinavia on the second trip. All, all the countries lost. Down below. Also, you can check out on my Twitter. It's the pin post at the moment. So, um, as far as goes catching up with us, you're more than welcome to meet us at the start point of the climb or the hike. If you want to join us on the hike, that's fine, but you have to be able to walk at our pace, which we're not like going flat stick, but you have to be able to walk at our pace. But we can't like, because say it's, it's, it's a 10 hour hike up and back. We can't be like failing the height because someone is too unfit to get up or something like that, you know what I mean? But if we can walk at a faster pace, well then you're going to be in a very comfortable hiking pace, aren't you? How many shoes take? I've got, I've got like hiking shoes and I've got hiking boots so um pretty much if it's going to be really bad weather if the train's going to be uh like there's no decent path and or there's going to be snow I'll wear my boots if it's going to be just a nice smooth path and just an easy comfortable hike then I'll wear my um shoes Michael's packed his, like, ridiculously shit shoes. He bought $60 hiking boots from mountainwarehouse.com or some shit. Decky's the opposite. Decky's got, like, the most Gucci, like, clothing and shoes of all time.
Real boy, thanks for the 19 months, dude. Weapon crate. Same. AKS 74N. Roddy. recorded will it into existence has to be a little bit hang real crappy thanks for 39 months dude oh my god are you fucking serious in the back. Be rude. All right. Uh, EFT wiki. What is it? Gunsmith 7? Gunsmith 8. Oh, this is the Zenit one. I don't know if we can do this. I actually don't think we can do this. Like the first issue we're going to have is the stock. I don't have like most of the parts. Oh, well, that's, that's sucky. I don't think we can do it. I'm, I'm guessing it's not these... I don't know. Raiders don't drop the Zenit, but I don't think I just don't think we can do it in, in its entirety. <sighs> Alright. Um for today, that's gonna be it. I'm gonna I'm gonna go to bed a little bit early tonight. So I'm gonna go get some dinner and then I'm gonna go to bed and get up and I'll start my stream as early as I can wake up. The first major video for the Before Death channel goes live uh in four plus probably seven to eight hours time. Sometime between then then. Seven to eight hour bracket mark. So uh, keep an eye out for that. It's an app. It's honestly the, the the best video, the best video I have ever uh, been a part of making. It, honestly, we put a lot of time and effort into making it. It's a lot of fun to make, and uh, it's a lot of banter. So hopefully you guys enjoy it. A lot of editing involved, and that's the first of all the videos that we're going to be posting on this before death channel is to showcase out. It's like the bonding the, of us before we go to Europe.